distance. So Dennis, you're asking if this male lion has any brothers. Well, we don't know if they're brothers, but he does have fellow coalition members. So there's three others that are form part of the Birmingham Boy Coalition. So there's four in total. And I'm not sure where the other three are. I think there's one that is further north of us at the moment with a female from the Torchwood Pride. And I haven't seen anything else. Well, I haven't heard anything else of the other two. But they were around the other day. There were some were seen on the southern side of us. There was one that was on the western side and then one in the north. So all four were accounted for. Look at these teeth when you opens his mouth. Massive. Oh, that's nice. And look at that mane. Does he not have the most impressive mane? Come on, you big roar for us to close out here. Come on, big boy. Definitely some yawns. But at least he's giving us some sort of action to finish up the day. And oh, look at that. Those canines are huge and all in perfect condition still they are long they're not too yellow yet and he's definitely now starting to wake up this is typical of a waking lion yawning grooming and it's often an indication that he's thinking about standing up and walking it might take a while it might take probably another half an hour or so for him to really get going but he's definitely now starting to wake and unfortunately it's too late for us <laughs> Mischief, you say, looks like he wants to hit the snooze button. Well, yes, I think so. I think he wants to hit the snooze button at some point. But now that night has fallen upon him, the snooze button is going to have to wait until a little bit later. You'll find he'll patrol for a while, and then you'll find somewhere to lie down and rest for a bit during the night, and then back up again before dawn to carry on his patrol, if he doesn't hear anything. Obviously, if he hears something dying, he might go that way, or if he hears females, he might head in that direction. It's all a little bit different. So our poor male lion, unfortunately, didn't give us a roar, but he certainly gave us a beautiful sight underneath that setting sun. So either way, it was very nice to see him, and a welcome surprise after this morning. I really didn't think we'd get any chance of seeing this male lion this morning.